Okay, I have a confession to make. A short story on how this channel came into existence. About 4 years ago, I wanted to purchase an affordable yet premium laptop. Like every smart head on this planet, I went and opened the doors of the internet. As expected, I was flooded with lot of information and warning bells were going bang bang bang. I gathered a lot of information and now my tiny brain had to do a lot of sorting and filtering based on the laptop requirements. Slowly yet steadily I went through all the products that I had collected. I had to drop almost all the laptops I had considered except one. The one that fit my requirement out of the blue. It was the HP NV13 2015 model. Now that I knew what I wanted, I buckled up, got ready and threw open the doors of internet again. complete silence and i felt as though i had slipped into a different dimension by mistake after persistent searching with not a lot of information to chew on i made my mind i decided to bite the bullet and ordered hp nv13 the world's thinnest laptop in 2015 that is when i decided to share my experience the information that i was to share shall help someone as smart as me looking for this laptop on the third rock from the sun this peculiar thought of mine gave birth to this youtube channel fine then enough of history i highly recommend not watching those old unboxing videos come on let's unbox this latest hp nv13 i ordered this laptop directly from hp and it was delivered in a couple of days given what is happening all around the world i think hp has got the process in place to keep products on the move As usual, we have a sealed cardboard box. Yet this is not as premium as the one you would get with Dell XPS. Given that this HP is just half its price, I wouldn't complain though. Let me just break open the seal. The box has the NV branding along with the Bang and Olufsen branding too. On opening the box, you are presented with the laptop on the top. It has got the new sharp modern HP logo. The laptop comes in this natural silver color. There are no other color options at this moment. Let me get the exact model and technical specification here. Some paperwork. Comment down below if anyone really reads this. On the side, there is a compartment that holds the laptop charger. The power supply is small and quite handy too though it has the proprietary HP charging port. I'll have to check if this laptop can be charged using USB-C. This along with many features will come up in the full review of this laptop. So definitely get subscribed. The last one in the box, a handy USB-C to full size HDMI adapter. I'm really pleased that HP threw in this adapter as this is the only adapter that I may ever need. Okay, let's get back to the laptop. It has this plastic cover to help protect the finish and I highly recommend you pick up a sleeve to keep this finish for years to come. The laptop is nice and dense. Hope HP has used high quality material here. This laptop is very compact. Let me compare it with the 2015 HP NV. Clearly, it has reduced in every dimension apart from the thickness. The old model is not touch sensitive, whereas this model has a touch screen too. On the side there is a USB type C port which can be used to connect to external display. A USB type A port, a 3.5 mm headphone mic port. On the other side there is a micro SD card slot, another USB type A port and the charging port. There is the HP NV branding on the laptop which looks simple yet elegant. Okay. Here we go. Let's try the one hand open method. 
Unfortunately, this laptop cannot be opened with just one hand. The keyboard is full size and the keys are big and nicely spaced. There is a fingerprint reader which should be quite handy when logging into windows as this laptop doesn't support windows allow. There is also a button on the keyboard that enables a physical camera shutter. Nowadays, I see many laptops with this feature and slowly it will be a norm soon. The laptop includes a glass trackpad and based on my previous experience, it will be worth the money paid for this laptop. The trackpad on my 2015 laptop is still going strong. This model comes equipped with NVIDIA GeForce MX350 graphics card. Theoretically, it should help with better graphics performance during gaming and editing. I would check this during the full review of the laptop. I picked the version with full HD screen. As you can see, the bezels have been trimmed down yet it is not as drastic as the one in Dell XPS. There are these small rubber feet that help protect the finish when the laptop screen is propped open. So, this is the unboxing and initial impression of the 2020 HP Envy 13 laptop. Hit like if you enjoyed this video and definitely get subscribed as the full review of the laptop is coming soon. Cheers guys.